guys welcome back to the vlog we are starting the vlog off saturday kind of afternoonish. it's like 12 26 i woke up washed my hair flat ironed it so now i have fresh hair today um we're about to actually start making breakfast um boyfriend's actually making breakfast he went to work this morning and i came home and cleaned and now he's making breakfast um he's brushing his teeth and then he's gonna finish up making the breakfast stuff because my stove was so messy now it's all pretty and white he <laughs> he clean and here's the breakfast we're making pancakes it's actually this mix we got from sleepy bee and honestly i don't know how i feel about it Bleh, feel about it because i like the pancake mix the pancakes from sleepy bee but the last two times we made pancakes the first time they were too thick and he put the blueberries in too late so they were like raw around the blueberries because the blueberries were frozen second time they were thicker blueberries were not like they were cooked but it had like i don't know i just didn't like the flavor of them third time's the charm hopefully we can get these pancakes to taste good i just don't like homemade mix i think i'm more of like a just give me a box of Aunt Jemima that tastes the best the one where you have to add like the eggs and the oil and stuff this one you have to add the eggs and oil but it still has that like one time i made tried to make pancakes pancake mix from scratch and it just didn't taste good so that's kind of what this batter tastes like to me, but hopefully we can make it better today. We're supposed to be going to a flea market after breakfast at some point. I honestly, I feel really lazy. Like I don't want to do anything, but I feel like go outside and do something. You don't want them to get too, uh, too warm just yet. Cause they'll burn. No, it'll just uh, make the whole uh, pancake blue because it'll start to get that juice. Yeah, but you put them in like as soon as you put the batter down. Because they're frozen. Now. Eh. Getting crazy. Maybe that's enough. I'll stop. <laughs> no more. <laughs> Let me, guys, let me show you guys what he did. So, you know, I showed you I got that new frying pan and I was so happy to have it. Let me show you. Look at the spatula that comes with it. He was using it outside on the grill. He's like, no, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It's not fine. I didn't get mad at him, though. I forgave him. It's called growth. Hmm. I just talk about you like you're not in the room. <laughs> like it's gonna be a pretty pancake though. It's probably cooking too fast, but it's gonna be pretty. Yeah. You can do it. You got this. Ah! Oh no. It's pretty though. Too many blueberries. Oh no. Their own republic. <laughs> now the frying pan's all ugly. Maybe just pour the next batter on top of those. Like scoop them out. I feel like I should go sit on the couch or just like clear out since he's man in the kitchen and I'm just kind of in the way. Or am I? <laughs> I do have a package to open. Let's relocate. I bought this ColourPop stuff before we went to Chicago and it showed up, I think, while we were still out, but they put it in, no, wait, I don't remember. Maybe it showed up when we got back. Maybe that Tuesday, I think it showed up and it was like outside my apartment. Now, I've been looking at these items for a while, but I wanted them to go on sale because I, I don't like paying regular price for things, but, they finally did go on sale, so I was happy to get them. Also, is this the right color? Cross that bridge when we get there. So it's the Peeps eyeshadow collection. I believe it's like seven colors. I believe it's seven. Let me take them all out. 
thinking about getting rid of all my eyeshadow palettes and just keeping a couple of the single pans like these just for easy just for easiness all right so we got all of them and they have cute little rabbit heads like the peeps this is the peeps collection and I got all the colors and they are all just like a single color but they have glitter so they're all glittery and pastel colors so what I like and this right here is supposed to be a white concealer so hopefully it is white because if not I'm gonna be pissed okay it is I use the white concealer I'll put it on my eyelids just to give me a good base because obviously I'm brown so a lot of the colors don't show up the way they're supposed to so if I put the white base down it gives the colors like a chance to actually look like what they're supposed to the last one I had for whatever reason the whole brush just broke off inside of the tube and there was just no way I could fix it so bought another one and I just happened to hop on the site when they were having a sale on these because I didn't want to pay 50 bucks, but I will pay 30 bucks. I wonder, should I go ahead and get dressed? I'm just kind of sitting around, not really helping. Do you want help? Hmm? Do you want help? No, I'm just trying to get this temperature right. Mm. Should we make like to avocado toast with the rest of that um, guacamole in no, there? No, we're already in pancakes. Okay. Um, maybe some eggs with some avocado. I don't know if I'm all that hungry. Maybe yeah. we'll just have pancakes because I do want to eat when we go out. Yeah, true. I decided on my outfit because I knew it was going to take me longer to get dressed. So I went and did my skincare. And here's my outfit. And I believe it is almost pancake time. Oh. He gave himself all the ugly pancakes and then these are my pancakes. So sweet. Hey, I might make a chai latte. You want yeah. one? Sure. You want one? Uh, no, I'm gonna have coffee. He's a coffee boy. Yeah, because you didn't get to, I mean, you went to bed late and you're like up yeah, going to like work. Six day of work, up early, didn't sleep very much. Went to the gym last night. I'm just like, I'm so well rested, everything's great. <laughs> and you're like, I'm so tired, I could barely function. <laughs> yeah. Aw, do you want to take a nap? I probably should today at some point. I mean, I feel, feel all right. Do we have ice? Yep. Yeah. But well, we need to refill those. You don't need to refill those. <laughs> That's enough. You want a cup? What are you drinking out of? You want this one, this one, this one? No, don't put more ice in my cup. I feel like I've showed you guys how I make my chai lattes, but I do my ice and then I have like my flavored syrups right here. This one's vanilla, this one's hazelnut. Um, I think we're gonna go a little bit of vanilla and then a pump of hazelnut. And because now I make my chai latte mixture at home, that's what this is. I made too much, so I had to put it in two different containers, so. in there. Do some milk. Not creamy enough. I actually gonna put a, like a splash of creamer in there. Just a little bit, cause this stuff is sweet and it takes like hardly any of it to make everything too sweet. I 
delicious. Love chai latte. Look how he decorated my pancakes. With little blueberry nipples on them. They're so cute. Do you want eggs? Yeah, always. Always going for the egg? I feel like if you have an egg, I should have an egg. But I like having meat with eggs, and we don't have any meat. Do you want me to make you an omelet with just cilantro? No, I don't. <laughs> Would you like a cilantro omelet, cilantro babe? <laughs> What's wrong, babe? You barely touched your cilantro <laughs> omelet. <laughs> Are you gonna make an omelet anyway? Um, yeah. Do you wanna have, it? You wanna have some of my omelet? Yeah, I'll eat some of your omelet. Okay. Sitting down to eat, I have a little less than half of his little breakfast ami that I didn't really want. Well, I said I didn't want, but I gladly accepted. Cause that's how it works. You have the baby fork? No. You have the big fork, no, no. okay. I don't like getting the big fork. Yeah, it's all sticky. Pepper jack cheese is the best. Oh, with the peppers? I like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're leaving. Okay, he likes to yell it. Where did we just leave? <laughs> Uh, Poke Hut. No, 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 the uh, the marketplace. Oh, City Flea. Flea yep. Market. So we just left City City Flea, and I got City a couple. Flea. City Flea. And I got a couple things. The camera's sitting on the dash. You're not attached to anything, so you may slide around, but I'll try to keep you guys safe. Um, I got a black glass straw because... Okay. Um, I got these cute sunglasses. Oh, wait, we're at the other corner. These fucking kids. Are those kids or grown women? They're grown women. Oh. A couple of Karens. <laughs> A gang of Karens. Yeah, just. <laughs> Ganged up. Just jaywalking. Yeah. We got these sunnies. Thought they were really cool and square. I don't have any like square glasses like this. And I thought the color was cool. And I have one more thing. Oh. oh my God, now they're reversing. What a horrible person. Oh my God, babe. Were they just fucking reversing? They were gonna not even wait until we actually started backing up until uh, they, what, they forget they live the there? With, oh my God. Oh my God. Who was honking? Were you honking or were they honking? Me, me. Uh oh. Um, yeah, because they weren't looking. Like, who just reversed? That kind of car has to have a backup camera. Like, it has to. They start putting backup it's cameras in, like, old cars. It's entitled drivers. Yeah! But I got this cute ring. <laughs> they need to leave. They need to leave! And then we went to Poke Hut. It was really cute, like the wall decor. And we got kimchi loaded waffle fries and, oof. And uh, what do we get, like a luau bowl? Yeah, it's like some sort of yeah. pork. Now we are on the way, are we stopping by your place? No. Don't you have to get a USB? Didn't you have to grab something? Do that later. Okay. 
So I guess now we're going back to my place to take naps and lay around. And heat stroke. Oh, boba cha. There's another boba mm. place down here. And it was like two bald head dudes sitting there with beards. Your people. <laughs> <laughs> you should have joined them. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. I'm going through a heat stroke right now. Yeah. <laughs> Is that what's happening to you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just stroking out. <laughs> yeah, we're supposed to be going to his friend's house for like a party. I was gonna say hopefully we don't stay there long, but it's fine, I won't say that, even though I said yeah, it. will be there for like an hour and a half, it'll be short. Yeah, that's not bad. Just a pre-party. Apparently there's gonna be food there, so I'm like, sure. I love the sound of food. Pizza. Music, DJs. Yeah, music, food, DJs, people, socializing, talking, smiling, laughing. <laughs> Probably handshaking, back slapping, or like hugging. All right, um, let's see when the next clip. What's up vlog, I'm back. <laughs> so yesterday, well I guess after the last footage you saw, we completely clonked out and came home i think we honestly took naps and did nothing and then sunday i we woke up at like two o'clock and we played i pretty much played the steam deck until like seven o'clock that night probably eight we went and got food came back home and went to sleep or watched i think we're watching the talented mr ripley I was watching that until I got so stressed out because I, I like the movie is so good, but I get so stressed out when people are doing things in movies and they're so close to getting caught and they just keep on doing bad things. And I'm just like, dude, Mr. Ripley, go back to the USA. You really tearing it up in Rome. It's time to go. They're on to you. And he just keeps on going. So I keep watching it in like spurts, it's like a two hour movie, probably two hours and a half. And I watched like first 40 minutes of it, went to bed, watched another 30 minutes, had to go ahead and turn it off because he's doing too much. Like eventually I'm gonna finish this movie. But I'm coming in because um, I'm working from home today because it is Monday for me. I am, uh, I ordered groceries on Amazon Prime because I love ordering my groceries on Amazon now, especially when I don't feel like leaving the house. Like it's Monday, I don't have to leave the house until tomorrow. I'll order my groceries online because I'm hungry and I need food. Um, let me go ahead and unbox all my groceries and show you guys what I bought. I really wanted Alfredo, so that's why I like bought all these ingredients to make Alfredo. Then there's like a couple extra things in here, like sun chips. These are so good. The garden ones are good. I bought the um, French onion dip ones. I think they're French, they're ones in the green bag. I bought them and they're okay, but the, the red bag is the best. Um, I bought these ciabatta, ro ciabatta rolls because I figured I can make little garlic breads out of them. I got a garlic basil vinaigrette for like a salad and these are not for me but in the morning time my boyfriend likes to have these for breakfast like when he goes to work he has one of these and then some other random stuff but these are for him we meant to go to Sam's well no wait yeah we meant to go to Sam's this weekend to get like the big case of them but it just didn't happen it just didn't happen so I figured I'd get those for him in the meantime I'm assuming this is my ice cream because it's just filled with okay yeah so I got the vanilla chocolate almond Haagen-Dazs little chocolate bars even though I have entirely too much ice cream and I probably should stop buying ice cream. You would think I'd have more bags for all the stuff that I bought, but I guess not. We got 
a lemon because I wanted to squirt some lemon on the chicken that I'm gonna make. We got Italian parsley and some tomatoes for the salad. We got chicken tenderloins because I want to make little chicken, like lemon chicken to go on the top of the, um, the Alfredo. We got Italian mix because I'm going to have a salad. Heavy whipping cream. Mozzarella cheese. Is that focusing? I can't tell. And then I have cream cheese because we're making Alfredo. Okay, I'm gonna put this stuff all away. Where is my pot? My new pot. Oh, here it is. Okay, I knew it was like clean and somewhere, but I'm gonna use my Ninja pot. This is the Ninja Never Stick. The Ninja Foodie Never Stick. I love this pan, I use it so much. Um, this is where we're gonna make everything in. We're gonna make the noodles, the chicken, the Alfredo, everything in one pot. And um, I'll be back when I clock out of work so we can start on dinner. I'm back and it's after work time now and I'm starting on dinner. I got this new mandolin, ma mandolin off of Amazon and I'm gonna use it to slice up my potato tomatoes. I already have my noodles on and I just want to try this out. I believe that's the way it goes and you slice. That's not working. slicing the way I thought it would slice. All right, never mind. We're gonna use, uh, maybe a tomato is way too soft to use on this thing. That's unfortunate. So I'm just gonna dice up the tomato because this is just for my salad anyway, so. It was worth a try. It's probably for like more of a stiffer kind of vegetable or fruit or cheese and not this, so. Noted. All right, see the pot has this little pour spout right there so I can cook my noodles in full and then just pour the water straight out with the little pour spout. No strainer required. Okay, now I have my pasta all cooked and I'm actually gonna put it in this container because this is most likely where I'm gonna store my Alfredo anyway. I did have some tongs, but I guess I did not bring them over. All right, there we go. Is this the one the whole time? Huh. All right, I'm actually gonna put some garlic butter in with the noodles, just to keep them from sticking together. This butter is weird. I froze it by accident by having it in the back of the fridge and now it just has the oddest like kind of crumbly texture, but it tastes so good and I refuse to let that win. I'm just gonna put enough in there. All right, so hopefully that is nice and coated. Put the lid on. And then I want to do like a light coating for chicken. So I got flour, lemon zest, some sort of garlic and herb seasoning, salt and pepper in here. And we're just going to shake up some chicken. I don't think I brought the lid over here. Let me grab that. There we go. Now what I kind of want to do is fry the chicken first and then make the sauce, because I feel like the sauce is gonna be really quick. So I'm gonna pour out this pasta water 
it's not that much but I did want to use it in my sauce I'm going to pour this in a cup and then wash out the pan add my oil so we could do like a light fry I believe my oil is hot enough to go ahead and throw the chicken on and I have my splatter guard to protect me from the spray that may or may not take place I didn't want to put that much oil in the pan just because I was only making three little pieces of chicken. That's hot, but not hot enough. I'm still going to throw the rest of the pieces in there. I'm just putting them around the sides because that's where all my oil is. There we go. Once this is done, it's like the quick part. The sauce is gonna what, take three, four minutes. All you're doing is just combining milks and cheeses together. Um, and then I'm making a garlic bread, but that can wait. Also, I'm watching YouTube. That's why that's here. Let's see if it's time to flip. Ah, too soon. Definitely not getting brown at all. Flipped it too soon. But it's okay. Not gonna stop me from flipping this one. I'll just make sure this end gets really like coated. Back and all we have left to do is the sauce. So I already added the pasta water, some milk, butter, and salt pepper, and this garlic herb seasoning. So now I'm just gonna turn my iPad around and add my heavy whipping cream and the rest of my cheese and then I'm done. I grated mozzarella, put some Parmesan and I have cream cheese in there. It's hot because I turned off my AC because I didn't want the air to be cutting on while I'm trying to record. But I put on this sweatshirt and now my neck is hot. So I'm gonna pour that in there. I'd rather have too much sauce than not enough. Put a little bit more in there. I'm actually going to just go ahead and dump everything because it doesn't really matter. It's all going to melt down and become one anyway. So let's just move this along. I did go ahead and take the chicken off. It's sitting in a microwave so it isn't just sitting out in the air. And I also used that same garlic butter stuff and put it on the bread I had just to make like a garlic bread. I don't remember what else I did other than grate the cheese using that mandolin thing. It works way better for cheese. Probably way better for like stiffer vegetables. Tomatoes are way too mushy. I kind of want to add more milk or heavy whipping cream, but I don't want to get too crazy, but I kind of want to. Okay, I'm going to let this melt down and kind of become one. And then I'll be back when it's time to add my pasta. Sauce is all melted down. The AC is still on because it was super hot in here and I just turned it off, but it's still going. But I'm gonna go ahead and add my noodles. Here we go. I feel like my sauce is still kind of soupy, but I'm thinking once I just let it cook up a little bit more, it'll thicken up, especially with the noodles in there now. I may or may not add more cheese and stuff to it, but let's see how I feel. Honestly, I think that looks pretty good. I'm gonna put the lid on and uh, we're just gonna leave this alone. I'm actually gonna go turn on my garlic bread really quick, just on broil. Time to assemble the plate and then I am done. I'm gonna get rid of that. Oop.
put a couple pieces of chicken on there. Squeeze a little bit of lemon and that's pretty much it. Um, I don't have a fork over here. Hold on. It's exactly what I wanted. <sighs> All right. We're going to eat dinner. I'm going to wrap this up and then I'll be back probably, I don't know, tomorrow. We're going to my boyfriend's and I'm going to play, um, play my game while he does stuff at his place. See you guys in the next clip. So I've already washed my face and right now I'm just at my boyfriend's place. Um, I do want to say that you guys can see those back there, those light bars back there. Those are the Go V light bars. And in my bedroom, I have the Philips light bars. The Go V ones have way, but way better color variations. Like I'm kind of Saudi. I even have, I like paid all that money for the Philips, anything that I have because like, I don't know, the color change, the, all the scene options, the Govee light bars are way better than the Philips ones. I don't feel like that needed to be said, but I'm saying it and I'm upset that I even have the Philips ones. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call it a night um, just because I want to edit this video tomorrow. Um... I think that's all I have to say. I wash my face. Um, it does feel crazy to be holding my Switch after playing the Steam Deck all week. This like feels so tiny and like a toy compared to like holding the Steam Deck. Like I was like holding it and feeling like so much lighter, so much smaller in my hands. Like I miss this. But okay, if you guys made it this far, leave a loaf of bread emoji and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Oh.